at it. We're out here in Sonoma, Napa Valley, uh, doing a large project. The uh, purpose of the video is the stripping. Um, I'm going to show you guys how to strip the floors with a chemical, not a water-based stripper, not a machine, uh, by hand here. Um, Straightforward, people. The key to the stripper is that it's a liquid. Everything else you're going to buy out there is, is like a jelly or a semi paste, and they're not chemically hot enough. So you got to try to need to get the liquid stripper going. This is the best way to do it, only way to do it. This particular customer, she likes me because I'm picky like her. She likes things to be a certain way. She doesn't want it kind of perfect. She doesn't want it decent. She doesn't want it okay. She wants it to be as perfect as it can be. She understands the machine's not gonna get it the way she wants it. She understands the only way to get this type of thick stuff off, as you can see here, we're scraping it off. It's so thick and gooey. You know, this is years and years of sealers and, you know, other people's attempt at to restore it. And basically, you know, what everybody else, you know, other than what I do, you know, your only other option is to clean it. And that's usually what happens. So she thought she was getting what I, I'm giving her right now. And the guy came in with some machines and... Ran his little roto zip 3000 on it and then he made it shiny. And as you can see, you can see the color of the grout here, to like over here, how dark it is. So basically, what he did is he just, and he just sealed in more dirt. So he just made all the dirt shinier. So she knew this time around, you know, that she wanted it done the right way. The only way. I've already, you know, there's no need in experimenting or trying something different or trying a different technique. I've already tried everything. There's nothing left. But there is a faster way, a better way, a cheaper way. You know, when you do jobs like this that are 3,000 square feet, you know, you start using, you know, three, four, five hundred gallons of stripper, 800 rags, brass tip brushes, plus you got to pay all the man hours. You know, these jobs start getting up into, you know, $10 a square foot or so. You know, give or take a little bit, every job's different. You know, we're definitely not the little carpet guy that's going to come out and charge you $1.75 a square foot and, and do what I just described before. But you can see the difference, the, the by hand technique difference. You can see I'm really getting it out of the grout. You know, I can really focus my attention and my detail to each individual tile. And I think that's the, you know, what my customer likes is that we show each tile, the individual customer, and pretty much I just, you know, I give the floor the business, people. I'll make it the way you want it. And I promise you, it's not, you could try to clean it. You've already tried to clean it. I promise you. You're that damn picky. That's why you're looking up how to do this. So don't pay some guy with a carpet machine to come out and clean your floor and make it shiny. You can do that. So anyway, though, people, this is how you strip a floor. I just showed you a couple tiles. This is a chemical process. It's a done by hand process. There's nothing fast about it. It's just real meticulous, making it clean. You can see how perfect the grout's coming out compared to how dirty and dingy it is. When you look over my shoulder here, you can see it's just starting to look like perfection. Stay informed. Do your homework. Make them show you videos, not pictures. Pictures can be fake, people. You could go on, uh, for some website, you can go on for like $1.99, buy pictures. Be careful. Google's a search engine. All half, 90% of those people on there are trying to sell you stuff, and they're trying to get you to buy stuff that's not even related to this. That's how Google is. It's a search engine. Do your, do your homework. Don't be a practice dummy. You should subscribe to the channel, keep getting all the good knowledge, 
I'll, I'll keep taking care of you guys. Yeah, I'm out of juice, so anyway though, out of juice, need to fill up. Like us, subscribe, share. Most important of all, just stay informed. Don't be an idiot. Have a good day. I'm out of here. I'm getting some work done.